Hello and welcome back. My name is Amulli and in this video I'm going to show you how to create Python virtual environment on Ubuntu desktop. So this is Ubuntu 19.10. If you have Ubuntu 19.04, anything above 16.04, you should have no issue following these instructions to create Python environment on Ubuntu desktop. So go ahead and launch your terminal. This is what I have. I'm quickly going to enlarge the font size so you can see it very clearly. Now you need to have Python and pip installed on your system. If you haven't installed, I'm quickly going to show you how you can install it. So simply go ahead and follow these um, commands. Type it in, in your terminal and run it so let's go ahead and first of all update the system sudo apt update type in your password wait for this to download everything and update it here we are it's almost done on my system so once it's done on your system let's go ahead and clear the screen and install Python 3 so if you have Python, uh, Ubuntu 19.04 and above you already have Python 3 installed pre-installed with your desktop Ubuntu desktop if you have not go ahead and run this command sudo apt install Python 3 if you want to install Python 2 just type this one sudo apt install Python once you've got Python, you want to make sure you have pip installed. So sudo apt install python pip for Python 2. For Python 3, you simply say python3 hyphen pip. So once you've got everything, hit enter and then press Y to continue. Now let's go ahead and check. So I've got python2. I also have Python 3 then I can go ahead and check to check Python 2 pip you simply type pip hyphen uppercase V and this is going to check the Python 2 pip version so it's going to be 18.1 and you can see it's coming from Python 2.7 now to check Python 3 you simply type pip 3 uh, then hyphen uppercase v so this is going to check python 3 pip version so it's going to be 18 and this is available here from python 2.7 so once you've got python and python 3 uh, pip installed on your system go ahead and clear the screen we are going to install virtual environment the package the python package it's a python package that lets you create a separate Python virtual environment on your desktop, be it Ubuntu, Mac, or Windows. So simply go ahead and type pip3 or pip and then simply say install and then type virtual env. And this is going to install virtual, e virtual env or virtual environment package for Python 3. So go ahead and hit enter. In case if you got Python 2 and you want to install Python 2 envir uh, virtual environment, you simply type pip install virtual env instead of pip3. Now you can see I already have a uh, virtual environment installed. I'll go ahead and clear the screen. And then I'm going to create a um, virtual environment within this directory, the user directory. Okay, So I'll simply type virtual env and then the name of the virtual environment so i'm going to say it env you can name it whatever you want okay env and hit enter now this is going to create the virtual environment python 3 virtual environment you can see it here and then also going to install few uh, packages so now once once it's created you can see it says done we will go ahead and activate it so this is how 
to activate Python virtual environment on Ubuntu source then the name of the virtual environment in our case it's env in my case in your case, case it could be anything then bin and then activate so once you've got the name of the virtual python virtual environment here in front of the username that means it's been activated now you can go ahead and check perth python v you don't need to type python 3 you can also go ahead and check the python pip uh, hyphen v is going to be the same from python 3.7 okay in order to deactivate it you simply say deactivate and you are out of the virtual environment python virtual environment once again you go ahead and say source and the name of the environment that's going to be env in my case not rnv <laughs> And then bin folder, you could get into bin and then you simply say activate. You can also go ahead and check what packages are installed. So we only have pip, setup tools and wheel. So that's it for this video. Thank you so much for watching this video. Please like, share and subscribe to my channel. If you have any question, leave in the comment below. I will try to answer it ASAP. Thank you again and have a good day.